question, but thank you for calling me Geek-tastic. <laughs> Bella Rauch. Be Bella Soy Soybean. You are amazing. Soybean. I don't know how they know to call me Soybean. That's you are amazing. Thank you for bringing. How they know to call me Soybean? That's you are amazing. Thank you for bringing Geek Tastic to Ivy. <laughs> Much love. Geek Tastic. What does that mean? It means I'm awesome. <laughs> I'm gonna read them for you because you're not reading. Mots. Okay. Traduits. Okay. Traduits. Siobhan, did you get my letter with the blue monster? keychain in it? I did get your letter with the Blue Monster keychain and the first thing I said when I got it, I screamed! I did! I had the same one! So I love it and thank you. Angie likes. Siobhan, did you see Dee Dee's shout out to you on Twitter slash Facebook? What was it like living with her? I did not see her shout out yet, but um, it was awesome living with Dee Dee because she's such a big personality and She's really cool, so we had a lot of great conversations. Patty Cakes 247. Siobhan, will you tell my friend Melissa happy birthday? We both love you. Happy birthday. And I love you too. No, he doesn't. I know, I know. Siobhan Brazil. She. <laughs> Are you going to make some new songs with Lunar Vowel? I just loved your songs. I am going to make some new songs with Lunar Val. Who's Lunar Val? That's my band. And oh, okay. They're awesome. So, yes. How'd you come up with that? Anyways. Name? From the semi Lunar Val in your heart. <laughs> in, your, in your heart. Oh, okay. Dude, it's Ben. Siobhan, do you still have an all time favorite artist, both musical and fine arts? Um. Musically, my favorite artists are Hanson and Hole. I love that. Um, um, musically, my favorite artists are Hanson and Hole. I love that. Um, <laughs> fine arts? I don't know. I, I love, um, I love all kinds of, of art. I don't know who's my favorite fine arts artist. <laughs> I like this next question. I enjoy Cowboy Bebop, for instance. It's a great anime. And um, and I like comic books and graphic novels. I'm, I'm starting to get into the Walking Dead series right now. It's really good. Ew. Are those little things more on my phone? Zuzu Pills. <laughs> Siobhan, <laughs> you doing Sid's version of My Way? <laughs> Zuzu Pills. <laughs> Siobhan, <laughs> you doing Sid's version of My Way would have been a showstopper. I feel robbed. Oh, and hi, cutie patooties. Lover. Karen. <laughs> Thank Lerv. you, Karen. What's love? Like love. Oh. Uh, I thought you meant lunar. Val. Want to read the next one? C. Kunzman. Siobhan, your fans love you so much. Did you know the AI forum fans donated nearly $6,000 to IMD back in your name? Wow. I didn't know that. I, the last time I had heard it was like 2000 but that's I'm incredible. Touching. And um, <laughs> just being a part of Idol Gives Back was so amazing. And... Um, I feel honored to be able to give back. So thank you. This one's from Renee Javier. Javier. Siobhan, what do you think about Alex being on If I Come From the Philippines? I think they're crazy for putting Alex in this house because other people have to live here too. <laughs> <laughs> but only kidding. I'm very proud of him. And I love him. For some crazy reason. Crazy, crazy. Denise two four two four says. Denise. What's up, Denise? How have you been? Loved when you sang "House of the Rising Sun." It was sung with so much passion. 
Can you give Alex a hug for me, please? Ew. <laughs> I'm just kidding. This is, this is from Denise. Siobhan, I was at the rehearsal taping on Tuesday. I asked you about your tattoo, your revolution of new cheers. I'm in. Keep screaming. Oh, heck yeah. Um, that was somebody who was in the the like front of the audience on Tuesday night. Cheers. You know, instead of just woo, was doing <laughs> and uh, <laughs> Wepaws.org. Siobhan, did you know we named a rescue cat after you? Tell us about your pet cat, Ophelia. I got your letter about the cat that you named after me, and I nearly cried. And thank you so much. That is the most incredible thing. Um, my cat, Ophelia, um, I just, I really like the symbol. It's a symbol of protection. I really like the symbol. It's a symbol of protection, and I'm really into Egyptian mythology. And um, but I am a fan of Adam Lambert, and he's awesome. Three thirty-three p.m. says Siobhan, did you get a lot of fan mail? Did you enjoy reading it? And what was your favorite? I did get I did get some fan mail, which is which is cool. I like this one letter I got from these two little girls. It was like, Dear Siobhan, we really like you on the show. You sing really well. Could you tell Tim and I said hi? <laughs> 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 and I was like, okay, did sure. You? Yeah, I did. I did. And um, But I think the best fan mail was, was letters from younger girls or like, like 13, 14-year-old girls who, who said that I helped them you know, be more comfortable being themselves and being different. And so that was really cool because it's something I've always wanted to do. Deborah JJ says, Hi, JJ. here's here's Dee and Amanda from Brazil. Um, Sarah Anupkath says, What what were your favorite spots in Salem? Um Definitely, like, all the old creepy graveyards and stuff are my favorite because I'm a creep. <laughs> and uh, just, like, downtown where, the, where there's, like, brick roads and cobblestone and everything. Kim Draxo says, Siobhan, what tat did you get with Lee and Mike while on the show? I got... Kim Draxo says, Siobhan, what tat did you get with Lee and Mike while on the show? I got... A Roman numeral nine, and it's on my hip. It's not on my bum. I don't. I I accidentally made a joke during an interview. I jokingly was like, "Oh yeah, I got I got Mike's face <coughs> tattooed on my left butt cheek, and then Lee on my other butt cheek." Or I don't know something stupid. But then then I I did an interview yesterday where somebody was like somebody was like. Oh, so we heard about your new tattoo on your butt. And I'm like, what? And it was, oh, yeah, they said in the New York Times or something. And I was like, oh. <laughs> you know, it's like, it was I so obvious. I, I think I showed that you were joking. I hope that wasn't my fault. Though. No, no, I think <laughs> it was somebody else. That, I don't know. Whatever, it's funny. <coughs> Lee Wise Quotes asks, <laughs> I like I like your your name by the way. Um, Siobhan, who is your biggest fashion influence? My cousin Connell, he's three years old. And he is my fashion icon. Him and <laughs> and my boss's son Zane, who's four. And um, I like to call it Lost Boy Chic because Connell and his sisters are really into playing Peter Pan. Whenever I babysit them, we have to dress up, and we'll always end up with, like, leaves and sticks all in our hair 